week and I um okay hold on so I caught this is a long story so if you're recording it's, okay. it's gonna take a while. Plenty of memory. Um, I gave you some before. All right now now I feel the pressure. Yep. All right so uh, so when we went Colin just sit down bud. You're at So we went and uh, I thought I was gonna be in the gym for two minutes to just put, his, put their names on. So I take all the kids out of the car and I, I'm holding Devin. No stroller, I have no drinks, no snacks, nothing for the kids. So we go in again thinking I was gonna be out in two minutes. So we go and there's a huge line. Mommy's telling a story. And they changed the registration policy. So they said, you know, we're taking registration right now. So you basically have to sign up, pick your classes now and sign up. So I'm bribing the kids and I'm like, I'll, you know, Anything you want for dinner, movies tonight, whatever, just behave. And I said, and we'll also go to the ball pit area. They have this big, huge tunnel ball pits for all the kids to play in. So I said, we'll go there after if you're good. Is that like an armpit? What's that? A ball pit. Ball pit. Go ahead. Don't you know ball pits area? But, well, it sounds right, like a crotch. So 45 crotch, minutes ahead. later, so it's about 6.15 at night, we're out of there. So, of course, we go to the ball pit area. So we go up there, and they're playing around. And um, again, I have no, no food, nothing. I'm holding Devin. Mommy. The kids are playing. Brendan comes out and he's like, Mom, I have to go. Mommy. So I'm like, crap, because he's a kid that you need to find a toilet within 30 seconds, hey, else it's a big problem. Right, so, it's like a hand grenade, yeah. Right. So we, uh, mommy. yeah, hold on, sweetie. Hey, watch me on. All right. Um, Maury, so I'm, the chair. I'm getting all, I'm getting Man, be all quiet. the kids. <laughs> I'm getting all the kids, like grabbing their sneakers. And so I'm holding, I'm holding Devin like this, sneakers piled up on me, running to the bathroom, like bare feet down the hall, all the kids. And then I knew Brendan had an accident because he starts walking funny. But then meanwhile, Devin, I was wearing a shirt that had buttons as a strap. Devin undid a button and he pulls down my shirt. So I'm basically flashing everyone in the gym, running down the hall, <laughs> looking for the bathroom with my kids. So anyway, <laughs> it's just bad. So we get in the bathroom. So Brendan's trying to get the rest of his poop out. So he's in the potty. And then I'm out. It's a public restroom. So I'm holding Devin like this. Colin's like, uh-oh. He had an accident. And he never has an accident. And not a pee accident. He has a poop accident. And it means the most disgusting poop. So I'm sitting there, again, with the bath in the bathroom, holding Devin like this with my shirt down with two kids who have accidents. So anyway, so I'm people are coming in and out and I'm sitting there leaning down, holding a kid with again like press out and I'm trying to wipe butts. It's just bad. Okay? So then that's so basically they get um they get them all cleaned up. I threw their underwear underwear away. He's upset because I threw his Thomas underwear away. So I bribed him that I'd buy him ten more and then we're out of there. So that was my uh well, that was my story. It was a birth control story. Wow. How's that? <laughs> How's that a birth control story? Oh, yeah, I appreciate huh? that. Really. You like that? That sounds like a poop control story. How's that a birth control story? No, because he was saying that earlier.